Hello everyone, this is part two, or whatever you can call it, on how to draw easy. And I want this this one's gonna be about how to draw a boy. Last one was a girl. I'll put it see the pictures right up there if you wanna watch it. And it was very and I teach y'all how to draw e neatly without many mess ups. And if y'all are new and y'all haven't watched that other video and you're I'm gonna show you the pencil I the thing I'm using. I'm using coarse pencil. You can use any pencil you want. But I'm gonna use coarse pencil. So let's get to it. So y'all, this is how to draw a boy. So let me teach y'all. So y'all want to go to the picture at the front, at the top. And then type head. Search a head. Then we'll obviously need to use a male head. That's male, if you're looking for it. Then place it down. Then, you're going to go to layers and make it to 17. Then get your pencil, pen, whatever, and, and kind of go, go to number two. I mean, go to number one. And then, like, draw. Kind of make it a little messy. That's what I kind of said in the last video. See, look, here's a head. Oh, hold on, let me just... Here's a head, and you want to outline it. So do this. Kind of make it a little messy, you know? Some people will say, like, Oh, you didn't make that bit. That make that... You didn't make that picture. You know? But why am I supposed to care? But don't do this when you're doing the head. Don't do that. That'll make your art look weird. And I'm doing this on IBI's paint. If you didn't know, because some people are new, they haven't watched my other video, I, I haven't, and in the in the title it says IBI's paint, so y'all should know what I'm using, but if y'all don't, that is okay, I don't know, the reason why you can't do it on any other platforms, because usually it doesn't have like this stuff. Like that. You know? So that's why I use IBI's paint. Because it has more tools what can help you out. More tools that can help you. Alright then, when you're finished drawing the head, now you want to... Now this is all up to you. The head was just to help you out. Also, like for the ears, make X's. So you don't have to do all that work. And I'm going to use one of my characters. Y'all can copy what I'm drawing. See, this, this is how he looks. But now we're starting with the neck. So the neck is all up to you, but it's very easy. You can copy what I'm doing to help you out a little bit. This might be a little tr more tricky because, you know, you know, you got that detail to this one. But it should be no problem. All right, so this is what I said for the other video. So you'd want to, where the, like, head, the, you know, the shoulders should be, make a line and make a line. And you're like, the heck? Why are the heck we're making lines? Just just hold on, let me finish. And then, do you want to do that? You're like, this is stupid. If you're new, but you'll understand. Then we kind of make circles into it. Y'all can kind of make it out, but I kind of want to make it jump in. I'm using, I'm using just coarse pencil so y'all can see it better because y'all can't really see it. So, now, what you'll want to do is go to number two 
and go to red, the color red, and kind of do this. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Delete number two. Actually, delete number two. And then make a new layer, okay? And then you'll have two again. And then use be using two. Then do that. And then do that. Don't do this. Don't. Don't. Do this. Like that. I'm going to change my brush off and see it better. Do that. Okay? Just like that. Hold on. I messed up real quick. Hold on. See, like that. Now you might be like, oh my god, why does it look like that? Hold on. Now, you know, like, why is it so straight? Yeah, we're going to that. So kind of do this. You see, like, do that. And I'm like, oh, this makes more sense now. Yes. Just keep look watching. Now go to make... Now erase wait yeah erase this erase that and now here you all might be like oh my god this is so stupid i don't know what she's doing lower the uh no Lower the opacity to number two. Then go back to number one. And make sure your thing is on black. We don't want this. And then do this. Trace it. So it kind of seems like you did it yourself. This is just a tool to help you for beginners. Or you're not really a beginner, but you need a little help with this. Making shoulders, head, or even eyes. The eyes is a little tricky, but I think I got it. Now go back to number two. Delete it. And then you might be like, there's still something there. I know. Let's delete it. So we're, now we're going to erase this. We don't need this. We don't want that here. We, don't, we want this to look like a good drawing, you know? So now erase all that. And we can go back to what we're doing. Now kind of, now kind of make a little so it has an arm, and I'm gonna just do fix up my thing. Let's see, I'm fixing up the jacket, make it a little big, and lower the opacity, and then color it in. Y'all can use colors, but I'm just gonna use you know black and white. Because I don't want to go into much detail here. Because I'm just teaching y'all. And like the video if you if you think this helped you or didn't help you. Comment what you want to see next. Comment what you what you need help with. And I'll help you out. Or if you got it, you're very smart. But if people who don't understand how to do it, that's okay. You'll learn in the future. So now we want to move back to the head. I'm going to focus kind of more on the head. You see how it's so not detailed. Just is like, oh, it's just a head. Maybe oh, just a boring gold head. Yeah, I know. We're getting there. Now I'm going to do the nose. The nose is a circle, like a circle like that. But if you're not good and you're only good at making like these type of circles, that's okay. Go to the finger and then press this one right under off and then make your screen straight and then do that. Make it a little big. Widen it out. Then there you go. You got it. And then turn it back off. You can kind of color it in more so people can see it. Then do the green lines. Then make the mouth. 
y'all can copy what I'm doing to help y'all out a bit. Because this is just trying to teach you. So, I'm going to do the mouth last because, like I said in my other video, I do not want to know what to do from the mouth. So, now we're going to move on to the eyes. So, the boy's eyes, it's, unlike the girl's, it's more kind of straight. It's not so... More like the girls. And they're more not so fat. It's kind of more fat. But if your boy character is like a happy character, do whatever. Shine. But I'm going to have my boy. Because mine's a little grumpy. So, now make the pencil a little bigger to color the eye, the eye pupil. So, the person can obviously see. And if you're like, oh my god, I can't draw the same thing over again. It's very hard. Yes, we're getting to that. This is my favorite part. So now, wait, let me make this a little bigger so it doesn't look so creepy. There we go. Now, we're going to go to lasso. You might be like, but there's another line in a way was making it hard for me to do this stuff. No, that line does nothing. Just, you care about yourself, but you have to be cautious because it'll lasso anything you circle around. So now... Press the square right here. Now press copy. Press it again. Press paste. Now you're like, wait, what are, what are I doing? What? Press pers this one. Press the second one. Do this. There you go. You got a bad eye. And then... This might be a little still out, but then when you go to brush and you draw, it will only keep it there. You're like, no, what's happening? Yes, go back to lasso and press this. It'll take it away. But you might be like, oh, wait, why does my character look very weird? Wait, why does it look very weird? Help me. It's fine. It's fine. Don't think that it is. See, I don't still not I don't know what to do with my mouth. Now, cause mine looks a little crooked, I'm gonna get to the eraser. What the? Oh yeah, we need what's the number? It's eraser. Um, and kind of do that. And kind of, I want it more to help you. Outline everything. Now, do one line. And that. And then make a big line. That's the eyebrow. You want it to have no eyebrow? And then make your face. There. And you can kind of make it a little bigger to color that in. You can if you want. But I don't really do that, but y'all can. And, and then make this big and then put this to like about 25. You pick... If you're doing black and white, you're just doing a sketch, but on digital, do it. Now, now you want to put it back to normal, put the size a little down, so, you know, you have space to do some things. So now, if your character has hair, get some hair. So, my character has gorgeous hair. Oh, yeah, I forgot. My character is like a... 
boy with lashes, I'm going to be like, but only girls can have lashes. No. <laughs> Your boy can be whatever, how you ever want it. And plus, you can't always, don't always listen to the haters. Sometimes it's just because they don't, they don't get the things they want. Now color it. Perfect. Now it's time for the hair. Copy the hair. Don't care. Now go to make another layer. And go to red. Y'all might be like, bro, red again. And now make your hair. I'm doing this because this is how his hair is like. I would be like, ew, his hair is red. No, his hair is actually brown. So, yeah. But I'm not going to color it in. So, you know. Wait, I forgot how his hair is like. Hold on. I need to get my drawing thing. Got it. So now, here, okay, let me look. look let's see how I've been making this boy all right that's how his hair is like I forgot all about that and I forgot his his eyebrows isn't like that or I need to go to number number two I'm Getting what I'm doing. His eyebrows are much different. His eyebrows are this. Oh no! Let's not do that. His eyes. Let's lower this down. His eyebrows are like that. Now let's go back to number three. Let's go back to one. Go back to red. Okay. Oh no. Let's not do that. So let's erase that because that is wrong. We're, we're supposed to be like number three. Okay. So now his hair is supposed to be like this. Whoa. Too large, bud. I forgot all how his hair was. It's been a while since I made this guy. Like, I haven't been drawing him at all. Must cry. And lots of, like, lines, stuff like that. Now, here's from the fun part. His hair is kind of like Angel Dust from Has Been Hotel. You can go search him up. But, like, he has lots of, like, he, his hair is long. Oh my god, I can't get his hair right. Now make all the lines. Now go back to number one. If you if this is easier for you, you can lower down the opacity. You can if you want. Now do this. Go back to Black and trace what you did. You can kind of make it a little better if you want. That's what I'm going to do because I don't really like those little twisting things. Nah. 
I, oh my gosh, why are you breaking up on me? There we go, that's his hair. Now you can go to three, you can delete it. <laughs> you can go to number one and erase the head. I'm going to kind of get this bigger so, you know, the hair for the head. Because the head kind of, you know, showing. There you go. Now you can lower it back down. Do that. And he also has this. I'm having my book right beside me so I know what he looks like. Yippee! I forget the things I draw a lot. Oh, yeah. He has... Oh, yeah! I was about to draw something totally different, which he does not have. Now I'm going to go to... Do that. I forget what side I drew this on. And he indeed has a crack horn. Indeed, he does. Oh, well, that's a too little close to the other horn. Oh no. anything right. This is dumb. And then, yeah, okay. So now, we're going to go and make his details. One of the details is he has a tail. Because, you know, he's one of, he's a god. But not really much people know that yet. I'm going to add the tail last. Should I make a comment, comic about him and like my, I'm not sure. His wings are broken from lots of fighting in the past. But whenever you see someone with holes in his wings like that, oh, that's just normal. So like this one. Sometimes he just is born with that kind of stuff. We need some sharp. Wait. It's about to say, we need some sharp things going around right here. I'm just going to do this. I hope this works. Copy. Paste. Hope this works. There we go. That worked really well. Now I'm gonna go back to brush, you know, and kind of coat it this in. Make this a little big because it's black. 
but I don't want to color the whole thing black. It's take a long time, and it's gonna make it kind of look weird. And gray is a good color. All right, now we're going to add. Oh, it's already on black. Now we're gonna add his tail. There you go. And that's how you draw a boy. I hope this helped you out a lot. I kind of really hope. Oh, yeah, and there's one thing I forgot. His little, his little cute bow tie. His little cute bow tie. He has a little bow tie for people to know he's a little fan fancy little pants. He's a little fancy pants. I'm going to make that a little, I'm going to go to gray. I'm going to do that. I don't want it. And then... Oh yeah, I forgot, like the whole thing. I'm gonna go back to black. It has little buttons. And so that is, don't have a name for him yet, but his little fancy pants. And he always tries to work things out. He's never, he's never rude. He respects, that's what I remember. Making him like he respects brown brown bleh, bleh, boundaries. All right, I hope this helped you out. How to draw a boy? This is just my style. I kind of like make him like more like that. But this is my style. Do your style. Do you? I hope this helped you out a lot. But if you're not good at drawing eyes, tell me in the comments below. And I'll see you soon.